give you rewards and the game will automatically create the crossword just like this all right we're here with the uh, crossword word connect game and let's play it cola you can see that it goes up here low call low call all right and co it's not a word and doesn't go up and uh, this crossword uh, is created by Hassan Hamidi this guy thanks man for creating this and uh, I used his uh, JS code inside construct 3 and uh, with some changes I created this uh, project and you can see that it's fast and reliable uh, code and you can add your words like local cola call and call and it makes this uh, this crossword immediately and you can see that when I click on uh, refresh it creates different crossword with those words okay now let's uh, let's go to the codes and see what we have okay let's take a look at generator.js file this is this is a pure JavaScript file you can see that I'm so dumb to understand what is happening here but it does the uh, creation of crossword uh, mechanic and uh, I'm with my little knowledge of JavaScript I just change it and put it in the construct to work with this gameplay okay so the part that I want to explain is here the event sheet that I'm expert in and uh, the f this file is free to use and you can download it from our website the link is in the description and when you use this uh, these codes don't forget to mention this guy uh, it's, uh, its link is in here and thanks man again and let's get it started in here okay this is the important variable we have and you can add your words and the game will automatically create the uh, crossword and the uh, letters at the bottom and just don't worry about everything at the words and the game will work fine okay and don't forget to use comma uh, between the words at the start and at the end to make the gameplay work fine okay also you can use this uh, use this variable you can change these numbers uh, for changing the size and position of the crossword okay in a start we destroy the extra objects and using this uh, using this plugin we load the JS file we have in here and after it loaded we call this function to change the uh, change the words to js array and after that we call create uh, js function which is this function to run the generator okay and in here in customize we have a uh, customization for uh, colors of some objects like line color selected circle color and you can uh, work around in here and change them we have this PG for uh, for making the background responsive at the start and in here we have this function create word that can uh, call by this file in here you can see that we call it in here with this pra uh, parameters and uh, yeah we create them from left to right in here from top to bottom in here and we set their uh, properties and uh, you can see that we call this add to letters list to call this function and actually uh, make unique letters from our words and after that we have this uh, words done function that calls by this file and this one calls when uh, when our uh, crossword created in the construct game and in here we need to call cam or camera to put the uh, crossword in the right position which is this position 
and also change the size of crossword using this action and we also call this shuffle letters to uh, shuffle the generated unique letters from this function to create them at the bottom okay so we here shuffle them and after that we create them using this function and every txt letter we have needs to have letter circle which is this object for better touching it and yeah in here we have the gameplay part you can see that when uh, when we start touching a letter circle uh, we change uh, we change its color we set some variables for starting uh, the touch and also we start typing and adding uh, the letter of letter circle to type word and showing it in here and uh, we use this function create line for for creating line for the letter circle that we mentioned in here okay and while we are touching while we have a current silk circle which at a start we have this started letter circle uh, while we are touching we need to draw our line using these actions and also when we touch another letter circle we need to set the size and position of the line and change the current circle to start drawing from this one <clears throat> this one sorry <clears throat> and also we create a line for this one and change its color and add its its letter to type word and show that and in here uh, we, we detect that already we touched a, a letter circle and when we go out of its area uh, it this uh, this variable goes to one okay and in here you can see that when we when we need to go back to the previous letter circle uh, I use this codes in here and yeah let's go to the next group check type word when uh, the touch end we need to check the typed word and in here you can see that if the typed word wasn't in the list of words list we call this word incorrect this function and if it was in the list uh, in the list of word list and in here we check for added words we have a list called added words and when we add a word to the crossword it goes to the list of added words so in here you can see that if the typed word wasn't in the list of added words we call this word correct and we need to uh, add it to the added words and do the other stuff else word already added and we call this function okay so let's go for each function uh, word incorrect resets selections okay reset selections goes and reset everything we done to the letter circles uh, just uh, like selections and drawing lines and other stuff okay so it does the reset everything and we have wrong word animation wrong word, word animation does the uh, does it does an animation for our takes the type word to uh, show that the word is wrong and also we set the color for txt type for word already added resets selections wrong word animation and change its color and after half second uh, we should uh, fade this out okay and we have this function word correct this is the main function we have in here you can see that at first we add the type word to the list of added words 
then uh, we fade this object out and after that we create txt flying letter for each selected uh, selected letter circle uh, to create the letters and go to the target which is spot and, and using these uh, these codes we fill our spots and this is our opacity uh, to enough spot when when it fills okay and after a little while when when the main job's done we reset the selections okay and I uh, explain for it these two and let's go to the next group okay in here you can see that after a txt flying letter reaches to its target when it overlapping uh, on another on another on another same text we delete it for example we have this uh, we have this let's let's just uh, fill the Port local call and cola. Okay, cola. It goes in here. We have double C in here, but well, we need to uh, delete one of them using this code. Okay, and we have this font size for our TXT flying letter object and level done. Okay, when our flying texts uh, go to their position, we check if all spots are filled and if that was true, the level is done and we print it in the console. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.